It's a real pleasure to be here today. And uh, I'd like to, uh, I'm here to represent Dr. Jim Bowes. Dr. Bowes, uh, who is the executive director of ICSPA, is not going to be at the conference this year. Uh, Jim lost his twin brother about three months ago and has had a problem walking. So Jim is in doctor's care and is in rehab recovering from that. Dr. Bowes asked me to welcome you to the conference and send you his best wishes. This is the first time he has had to miss a conference. Bowes, as most of you know, did not invent geothermal heating and cooling, but helped reinvent it, the geothermal heating and cooling in the 1970s with a lot of other, other professional people and performed some of the basic research to verify the energy savings. His research at Oklahoma State University led to the formation of ICSPA, writing of training manuals, and a simple basic program to calculate the length of the ground loop. The rest is history. I'd also like to, uh, 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 I'm very proud to announce uh, that we've had four courses going on since Monday. Uh, we've had 15 students in the CGD course, PLUS course, taught by Ed Lawrence. And if those students and trainers would please rise. Okay. Uh, we also have 19 students in the accredited installer workshop taught by 11 different ICSPA trainers. If the students and trainers would please rise. That was in that course. We have nine students in the accredited driller workshop taught by Garen Eubanks and Dominic Durbin. And if those students and trainers would please rise. All right. And 13 students and uh, a new course for us, and that one is the Building Load Analysis and Pumping Workshop. And that's taught by Chris uh, Baldback. If those students and trainers would rise. All right. We're also very proud to announce that ICSPA has created a new regional training center at the Pennsylvania Institute of Science and Technology. And I'd like for Ted uh, Giddings to come up to the front and receive this. <laughs> 